food is not somewhere else because I'm only 21 yet. What do you have to drink? Um, I had a little alcohol, alcohol drinks, just a tiny one. How, How many of them did you have? Huh? How many drinks did you have? Just two. And I had my third one. I finished my third one, but technically I was on my fourth one. But I had three of them so far. I had all three of them, the cocktail mixed drinks. What kind uh, of drink was it? The, uh, adios, um, motherfuckers. Uh-huh, you had two of those? Three of those. Three of those? my fourth one. I was technically just finished my third one. Okay. I had my third one, like, gone. But I had my third one on the little, the little thing for me mm -hmm. and my friend. And then I had my fourth one that I was going to ask. So you had four so far, and then how many did you have I after that? I had three, but I was going to get a fourth one. You didn't finish it? No, ma'am, I didn't even finish it. I didn't start And did you drink anything in the vehicle when you got in the vehicle before no, you left? No, I just had that one drink, which was it, uh, fully there, which is gone, basically, because so it was like, kind of like warm, but cold and seaweed. Besides the drinking, did you do anything else? Any drugs? No? No, that's just that one drink. That one solid drink. Okay. Because you were passed out in the car. Why did you fall yes. asleep? Um, because I had passed out earlier today, um, I was, um, didn't wake up, well, I didn't go to sleep this morning, I stayed partying, um, behind the party? Yes, ma'am. Since what time? Do you um, know what time it is right now? Um, uh, no, no, last time I remember it was 10 in the, um, 10 at night, but I was, um, over here at Hooters. And I, well, not here at Hooters, I was over here driving. Do you know where you're at right now? Whataburger. Okay. I had, um, what's it called? I had passed, I remember I had passed out pulling up to the um, sign. She had to go earlier. I remember it was like 9.19 or a crisp, a crispy chicken sandwich, mayonnaise. So they took your order? Yeah, I had, I, I just passed out. This always happens. I just passed out as You always pass out. Why? Even if I'm not sober or if I'm, um, sober as well. I just always come and I order and pass out. I can't always keep my eyes open most of the time when I'm sober if I'm not sober. I don't know. Always, um, I pass out anywhere and everywhere. So. By sober, what do you mean? As in just drinking alcohol? Or? Um, yes, like, um, just drinking alcohol because I was called me, my mom, and my stepdad. We just got back from Red Wall this weekend. So, um, this weekend from Red Wall, we just, I ride with, I rode with them. My stepdad, um, stepdad rode my car. Or I drove my car because we were behind him Saturday. Um, when I get drunk, I know how I get. So like, my mom wanted to leave my car this weekend. You know how you get, as in. Like when I drive, she didn't want me to like run into someone else or like just. Has it happened before? Um no. No. Just when I'm drinking, she just doesn't want that to happen because I had someone hit me when I just bought my car. So I just got my car in April. I just barely got that. That was my first car I ever got. That I got that on April 9th. I bought my car on April 9th. I didn't get my car fully to the week after. Which so you did have team. about three drinks and a half tonight. Yes, but I didn't. Okay. Like. So it's because you did pass out right here in the yes. driver's seat. I'm going to ask you if you're willing to submit to some field sobriety tests because I need to know if you're able to drive for you to go home. Yeah. You're willing to submit to them? Well, we'll submit to a sobriety test. Okay. So I'm going to have you go ahead and stand over here. That way we're not... Oh. Over here, ma'am. Yeah, I need to get those because I want to stand in my hooters, um, bottoms for work. So I don't have anything else. That Dos Equis, did you drink it? No. It's been there for a while? Yes. Um, after I was leaving the party, it was on the sidewalk and I didn't want the, um, what's it called, the sidewalk to have it. I, um, the party was over there off of behind, um, uh, what's it called, um, Hooters. It uh -huh. wasn't, um, after the stoplight, it was right there in this, um, Hooters spot, um, and the Hooters, like, distance between Hooters, or, like, between the light and the Hooters stoplight, or, I don't know how to describe it. I just know it's behind um, Hooters and okay. Red Circle. No, it's Deer Circle. I don't know. Go ahead and just put your shoes on for me so we can walk over there. <laughs> and just walk straight over there. I'm going to have you go ahead and stand right here on this line. 
So you're willing to submit to the test, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay. She's taller than me. I'm gonna have you go ahead and. Uh, no. I'm gonna have you follow the tip of my pen with your eyes and your eyes only, okay? Okay. Well, it's because I'm not used to have, like, this is my first car I've ever gotten. I've never had a car ever before this. So, like, the stuff that I have now is, like, new to me. So, like, me having my new, like, my own car by myself, me having my own place by myself with my roommate is still new to me. So, like, I don't know. Just seeing it from far away, I'm never, I'm still not used to it. I don't know. It's still weird. But... But I'm still happy for it because I still got it myself. I bought a 2018 Honda Elantra Sport Edition on my own. And it's my first car ever. And I got kicked out of high school. So I didn't finish my first semester my senior year. So, and for me getting that from just working Alright, so we're going to do the next test, okay? Alright. You're standing in that straight line. You can see it, right? Yes, ma'am. I'm going to have you go ahead and put your left foot on that line. You're going to put your, uh, your right foot in front of it, touching heel to toe. With your eyes to your side, you're gonna leave them on your side the whole time. Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. Oh my god, I'm gonna leave them. You're gonna leave them, there. okay, you're gonna leave them there. What you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be taking nine heel to toe steps down that straight line. When you reach your ninth step, you're gonna leave your lead foot planted. You're gonna take a series of small steps back, and you're gonna take another nine heel to toe steps down that line. The okay. whole time you're gonna be looking at your feet. Go ahead and put leave your hands to your side. You're gonna stay in that position until I tell you otherwise, okay? okay whole so time. Go ahead and stay in that position, how you work. Don't move from there. With your with your arms to your side. Okay, you may begin. Okay. So for this next test, I'm going to have you stand like this with your arms to your side the whole time. You're going to remain in that position unless I tell you otherwise, okay? okay. You're going to choose a foot of your choice. I'm going to be doing my right foot. Go ahead and just stand there straight. Don't move. You're going to choose a foot of your choice. I'm going to be doing my right foot. You can do your left or your right, whichever you feel more comfortable. Leave your hands to your side, please. Like this. I'm just playing my first time. Okay. Reason. Just leave them to your side the whole time, okay? I'm gonna do my right foot, you can do whichever, left or right. You're gonna raise it about six inches above the ground, parallel to the ground. Whole time it's gonna be parallel, you're gonna keep your hands to your side. The whole time you're gonna be counting 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, until I tell you to stop, okay? Okay, okay you may begin. 1,001, 1,017, Lift it up, six inches above the ground, parallel. Stop. Right, good decision. Um, I'm going to go ahead and arrest her. I'm sure. not sure. I, I filled I out my H-chan. Okay. Okay. All right, ma'am, go ahead and put your hands behind your back. Um, I have a phone in there. Can you take a purse? Do you have a wallet? I don't have a phone in there. Well, it's just my purse. I have you go ahead and walk over here quickly. Can I put any of my hair behind my ear really quick? This one? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. I just never been arrested before, so this is it. I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, search you. Go ahead and step out really quick before. I know you have your shorts on, but I'm just gonna make sure you 
Go ahead and turn that way. I'm gonna lift your... Yes, sir. Thank you. All right, listen to me. I'm about to tell you something important. You're under arrest for DWI. The New Mexico Implied Consent Act requires you to submit to a breath test to determine the alcohol content of your blood. After you take our test, you have the right to choose an additional independent test. If you choose to take the additional independent test, you have the right to a reasonable opportunity to arrange for a physician, a licensed nurse, or laboratory technician or technologist who is employed by a hospital or physician of your own choice to perform an additional chemical test. The cost of this additional test will be paid by the law enforcement agency. Do you agree to take our test? I need you to tell me yes or no. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Go ahead and 
center facing the wall. A little, a little bit more. Thank you. Just keep me in here. So much water. I'm going to go in. Going to the detention center. What? Yes. Take them off. Go ahead and put the, your hand up over your head, okay? Yeah, they're gonna come off. I'm gonna have you take off your earrings right now. Put your hand up over your head. This one too. Go ahead and take it. I'm gonna have you um, take off your earrings, okay? If you can. Just take it. Sit down, so she can check it out. Oh, 